want in on how I keep my inbox at zero? I'm serious. Emails may get delivered, but I know my way around an inbox that would knock your socks off. Grab a drink of choice because I'm spilling the tea on daily inbox hacks to live by. Tip one, find the time. Everyone has time whether you're going to admit it to me or not. We all have some sort of time. We just have to find it. There are many ways you can do this. You have the options like checking your email when you're in the bathroom, when you're commuting somewhere like subway or bus on your lunch break, or simply putting time in your calendar. Personally for me, I check my emails about three times per day mornings, afternoon, and evenings on my way home. Back in the day before quarantine, I know that sounds odd, but back in the day of subway rides to work, I would go through my emails and delete ones I didn't need. I have sent many emails to my my outbox, and when I was by Wi-Fi again, my emails were sent. Tip two. No and go. When I open my inbox, I can see right off the bat that I know what needs to go. It is all about the title and the starting sentence snippet that we see in the email, especially newsletters from my favorite blogs or websites that I love. They have to audition for me every time they send me an email. I know that sounds strange and I have a reason, I have a reason for my madness. I don't have the time to sit around and scroll through every email that comes my way. As much as I love my favorite bloggers and sites content, realistically, I don't have time to read every email. So the newsletters that come in, they're going to have to audition for my attention if they want me to read it. Tip three, create folders and label them. Don't let everything sit in one folder. I don't know about you, but it is so overwhelming to see many emails sitting there. Make sure that you are creating folders and labeling what needs to be in this folder. But most importantly, utilize your folders to store important emails. Tip number four, mark and read. I use this trick all the time. When I get an email that maybe I'm not too sure what to say yet or maybe don't have the time to get to this email the way that it needs, I mark it as unread so that I can come back to it later. That way, when I do return, it's lit up to remind me to actually reply to it. You are not going to have a clean inbox if you don't put the work into it. Use the tips (laughs) that I mentioned before. Effort equals result. So do it again, and then do it again the next day. I love helping out the best way I know how, so if you need some one-on-one help, DM a photo of your of a place that you're having trouble with, and I'll give you my best tips to help you through. Or if you need some extra help, I invite you to join my signature, The Organized Mom System, where I virtually coach you and help you take control of your household by removing clutter, mastering your time, and simplifying your life. I look forward to talking to you, you again soon. Hey, before you go, thanks for watching and get more information at cityofcreativedreams.com. See you there.